Hi guys, how are you doing? So in today's video I am going to talk about how to deal with life when it's getting overwhelming, when the external factors are coming out of the blue and you're having too much to do in one day and you just feel stressed and overwhelmed. So you can have phone like phone calls, random phone calls that come out of the blue, not scheduled phone calls. And it can be a bit overwhelming if, if the phone call appears while you're having something scheduled or, you know, those unexpected ex external factors and you feel you have too much to do for one day. So my first recommendation is you have to sleep at the right time and wake up at the right time. Um, I would always recommend sleep around midnight and wake up 8 9 a.m. or so. Those keep your a, a great rhythm, a great sleeping cycle rhythm going on. Otherwise, it's not healthy, let's say, if you sleep like at 4 a.m. and wake up the next day at 11 a.m. So, first of all, have a good sleeping cycle because the phone calls, usually unexpected phone calls, they don't come that early in the morning. So, you can already schedule what you have to do really early in the morning. Um, my second advice is don't over schedule like don't over put too much for one day i know you there's a lot you want to get done in a day and time is valuable to you but you have to put the right amount you have to put something that is doable otherwise you're going to get overwhelmed and stressed like putting the right amount is the right thing to do because if you do too less you're going to feel lazy and if you do too much you're just going to feel stressed so if you're in the middle, average, the, the average amount of time, you're going to feel better about yourself. Let's say you have priorities, you have dreams that are more important than other dreams. Put more time into those dreams and things that seem like a second base level, just put less time into that but do do it if it's important to you. For example, working out is really important to me. I have to do it for at least 30 minutes a day. It's not my huge priority, but it does go towards my dream as well, but slightly, so I would put more focus into my acting work than in my workout, because acting is what I want to achieve, and workout is also something that I want to achieve, but not as much as my dream. So you have to put a specific amount of time for each thing you want to do as a priority level. Um, for instance, um, I work out uh, in the morning, like really early morning, I want to do that first when I wake up because if you work out first, you're going to feel healthy and good about yourself first thing in the morning. And then for the rest of the day, you're going to be motivated because it creates endorphins. So if you don't start working out, if you don't start moving, you're not going to have a healthy day. So that's why I like to put working out first priority. There we go. Um, so yeah, put the right amount of time. For example, uh, like let's say your job or your work. If you, I do believe that 12 hours is possible. It's possible to work for 12 hours. Some people think it's too extreme, but I like to, you know, really take care of my time. So 12 hours is like the amount to work on. Well, to work on your dreams, I would do six hours because it's really important to me and I really want to get there. So yeah, I put six hours towards my dreams. Um, and yeah, 30 minutes of workout and there we go. So also if you're feeling overwhelmed and you're just like feeling depressed in your bed and everything, maybe have a rest, um, just take it easy, like keep reminding yourself, take it easy, we're human beings, we have to be gentle and careful about ourselves. So like maybe, I know I'm very skeptical about time, but maybe watch one video clip or two. Some people go into the online world as an escape. So if you want to, you know, have that time for yourself where the offline world is getting a bit extreme, have some inspiration on the online world, I'd say, or maybe talk to your family or your friends and they can help you out. 
and then they'll be uh, I had a time when I had a overwhelming crisis and so many phone calls came all at once and I was like this is just too much and there's too much to handle so I phoned my dad the next day and he said yeah don't have one of those crises and he really helped me out like how to figure things out so talking to someone is really the key thing to really feel calm and they can help you especially people who know you best because they know how hard working you are they'll say you should take it easy you've you're a hard worker and there you go there you go so these are my tips on not feeling too overwhelmed and really do take it easy it's not the end of the world if you don't achieve your goals straight away really it's not the end of the world just really take it easy but don't rest just take it easy don't rest balance like work hard but don't overwork or you're re it's really unhealthy there we go thank you for watching bye bye